hello beautiful people welcome back again to my youtube channel how are you guys doing so i'm back again with another video today with a title you know what you're about to watch so before we dive into this video today i especially want to take each and every one of you who subscribe to my channel like you guys i cannot thank you guys enough today we are twenty thousand subscribers i don't know how to start thanking you guys thank you so much for the love for the support for everything i say may the good lord bless each and every one of you in jesus name so today's video we'll be talking about kemi on Lyo and davido guys i don't know what is this woman's problem honestly her own is becoming too much the way she's attacking Davido is getting too much of her. I don't know if Davido is owing her or what. If Davido is owing her, let him go and pay her the money. Like, so before we continue, guys, I especially want to welcome those who are new to my channel. So if this is your first time of being here, you're highly welcome. My name is Jennifer. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel. When you subscribe, you will see a bell beside it. Click that bell so that it will enable you to know whenever I post a new video. I'm going to leave uh, a particular clip here. This clip will show you how to subscribe to my channel so that you will get all my notifications. If you don't follow this process, you won't be getting any notifications from me, okay? So subscribe and be part of this family. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. I do not take any of your love for granted. May God bless you. For always coming back to show me love. And for you that just subscribed to me, thank you so much. You are highly appreciated. So guys, there's this video clip I saw. A young man who was spotted kissing a little girl. And he was defending himself, claiming that the little girl is his sister. Even if that girl is your sister, the way you were kissing her is not right, it's not proper. Like that is how he starts. The news all over the social media these days is all about rape, and we cannot be making videos about it because YouTube will not accept it. It's getting too much. People really need to stop this. I also saw another one, a man who beat up 10 months old baby. You heard me right, 10 months. And also the child's mother, all in the name of what, that the, the child is making noise. He's crying too much. <laughs> hey, God, dude. what is wrong with Niger Bikun? Eh? Anyway, just watch the video clip. People should come to Lagos so that you can stay with me. She now come to Lagos. When she came to Lagos, Lagos and stay with me, I give him one instruction. This is her and she's weakness. Look at the way to handle baby. Look at what you can do so that the baby will make everybody to rest. And look at what you can give to the baby. But the, the problem that I have with if you tell her something now, my neighbor bear me with me, she will shout and start to insult me. And I call the guy several times, come and take this girl and his baby. Go, I don't want to see them here again. The guy will bleed me, I beg, I beg, make him stay. Okay, you now, hear something now, she don't want to hear. In the night, the baby will wake up, even though I carry or carry also, I will come talk, the baby will wake up, go cry, me and go kiss you. I tell her, say, when this baby wake up in the night, now breast, she the one so. Give her breast. She no go give the baby breast. She go they knock her. Stop crying. Stop crying. As in they knock the baby, he make the baby continue shouting and he make me no sleep. I tell her and say the way you they do this baby, I not like her. I no good. No be try it up. I say good they do good they do. This night I no sleep. As I wake up in the night, breast finish. I want sleep. I say the baby start to stop. I say they knock the baby. The baby continue to shout. <laughs> This morning when she wake up, carry the baby outside. I can't sleep. As I sleep, I hear when the baby they shout. And she's inside. What thing you they do inside? Go carry the baby now. You know one go. I say the baby can't shout. I go outside. If it waiting make you cry. I knock her. Stop crying. As you knock the baby. I beat the baby. You beat the ten months old baby. 
As a bit of, so you stop crying. I know you say me, I just carry her neck. I am where the mother come outside. Why you knock the baby? If you knock the baby again, you go knock me this morning. If you knock the baby again, you go knock me this morning. I push and come on. Say, so come on for you. I, I hold the baby. Please come. Say, push you. Come on, we'll see you. Push you. Come. I push and enter that water. Yes. Turn, please turn. Turn, turn, turn your back. No, we are listening to you talk. So, since I bring her here, she has been like, I get why I bring her here. Because even my brother, the issue that I get with my brother is this same issue. She don't want this thing. And she continues if we follow and talk. At times, I will give her money to go and buy baby food. Or do this one. You know, go carry the money, do what I give her men. You go go to your own. And you go make me first. I go give her money, go buy baby soap. She go carry her baby money, go buy another thing. You go make me first. I tell her, say, you be, okay now, the baby is not feeling fine since. For her own come up for a lot. At times, now me, they help and wash the baby from where the baby they sleep. She know they wash her. Why the crocodile will come up for the baby body? The baby clothes, you go keep them, you go dirty, you go dump everything. She know they do anything. Or she know just want to leave the baby. Make the baby gay, men do waiting one day for you. If I no talk, 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 she know go do that thing. Even when I talk, now so she go start to embarrass me. They talk to me anyhow. Don't say anything. My say neighbor anything. are here. They are bearing me with me. Am I not the one where they wash that baby uh, bed? That's not, that's not the issue. The issue, the issue is this morning. This the morning. Is, that's the uh -huh. that that same thing linked to this morning on the That's why you beat her up. She know yeah, That's why you beat her and the baby up. Talk, you know the year. Okay. I could tell her you know the year. Okay, this morning. So guys, you all heard him, right? I want to know your take on this. Like, what do you think about what this man just did? Do you support him? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. For me, I don't, okay? I'm blaming him for beating that Temmuz baby, okay? If it is with the mother, I don't have issue. According to what he explained, the woman seems to be stubborn, okay? But where I'm against him is him beating that Temmuz baby. I mean, he's just a baby. He doesn't know anything. That is kids for you, okay? And in the other hand, I also uh, understood what he said by he goes to work and come back late. He can't sleep. The baby will be crying and all. I totally understand. But that is not enough reason for you to beat that baby. Come. So I don't support you on this and it's not nice at all. So let me know your take on this, guys. Okay, please. So moving over to Kemi Olulayo and Davido. So according to the story, they said Davido uh, acquired the new house in Banana Island. So he went there to visit his house and he fell down. So he got some injuries on his leg. So that resulted to him using crutches. Okay. So a lot of his fans were praying for him to get better. But this woman right here, Kemi Olulayo, she have sworn that Davido is not going to rest. You need to see the kind of um pose, the kind of thing she was saying. Let me just share it. So she said, walk the walk, talk the talk. Sorry is an easy word to say. Soon it will be a wheelchair. Like really, Kemi Olunlayo, really. This woman, eh, her own done the day too much. Oh. So a lot of people reacted when she made this post. And someone said, I just found that Kemi Olulayo is working for Davido. She's just playing a mind game with all her posts. If you know, you know. Then under it, Kemi Olulayo responded back to him and said, I'm not working for Davido. Stop, stop the attention seeking. I hate Davido with passion. That is her word, that she hates Davido with passion. Hmm. So immediately she said this. Davido fans started reacting about this post when she said um she hates Davido with passion. A lot of Davido's fans started insulting her. They were cursing her. And trust this woman. She fired back at them and this is what so she said 
Anyone that causes me because of Davido, their cause will go back to Davido and his children. Example, Kemi, you will die soon, means Davido and his children will die soon. I don't do back to sender. I sell cause to the celebrity you are taking side with. The end. Hashtag Kemi talks. <laughs> this woman, eh? Honestly, <laughs> so guys, let me know what you think about this Kemi Olunlayo and Davido's um issue. Please comment down below. Let me know what you think about it, okay? Please, there's something I would like you guys to listen to about what this uh, woman said. Counselor, what's her name again? Odaro. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly. But just listen to what she has to say and I'll come back with the rest of my thoughts. What are you saying? I'm saying and I'll say it again. If my husband cheats, I'm not leaving him. I am dying with him. If you want to be the side chick, it's your business. Though. Maybe it's my fault that my husband is cheating on me. Maybe some things a woman needs to do at home, I'm not doing it for him. So if my husband cheats, I need to know the reason why he's doing it. If it's prayer, I need to pray for him. If it's pump, I need to pump him. If it's something I need to do to make that man feel comfortable, I will do it. Because it's for better and for worse. You will pump a cheating husband. I will. So guys, I want to know your opinion in the comment section. What do you think about what she said? She said she's going to pamper her husband if he cheats on her. You know, as usual, I want to know. Please, in the comment section, listen to that, okay? Because, <laughs> not mind me, guys. So let me just leave matter for Matthias and let's move ahead. Moving over, Nigerian man in Germany cry out for help that the German government collected these two kids and imprisoned their mother. So it's kind of pleading the public to help him. So I'm going to leave you guys to watch the clip. After watching, comment down below. Help me share my video in our social media platform. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all in my next video. Uh, good morning. Eh? Uh, good morning. Good afternoon. Good morning. If you can hear me anywhere, you can hear me. Good afternoon. Good morning. My name is Elise. And I live in Germany. So I'm here to, to talk to my fellow Nigeria brothers, my fellow Nigeria sisters, anybody that can hear me, understand? I have a two, two baby. This is the second one, Lara. Let me show you the, the picture of her. The second one, Lara. This is the other one. This is the firstborn, Jennifer. And this is the mother. FA. The German government they collect the two babies from us and the mother the mother where they, they put them for prison. Not to speak English, my brother. They think they pay me for mad. They put them for prison today so. Which is this is Mama so a newborn. A newborn never ever reach one month with a born so inside this corona period. German government, they say they see something for this new one for the newborn. You should see leg break. We ask the happen baby with the newborn. Never ever reach one month. I leg will take break. I leg want to break. They say leg break. They say injury. They can carry the first one. Join They say the first one. Be like they see some old injury. See they want to carry this one. They collected the two baby and the mama. I give her crazy. They prisoners with the talk. Which is a bed. Anybody will know say will feel help. Anybody will know say you know any lawyer will feel help. Or any organization with this journey will feel help. If the government of his still help us, a bed. See, see the foyer. Two baby and the, two baby and the mother. I should be talking about the, the mother, they prison. The mama. The picking that the they want to sell, I beg. Anybody who knows you go see her, I beg. I beg, do you see the video? I beg, let me share it. We people who know you still help me. We don't see her. I beg everybody, my name is Nairis. Nobody knows you know me for Jeremy here. 
at birth. This one, I wait till they pass through. These two babies so we born there for Germany here. Yeah. For Germany, they want food, my hand, collect her, put in my mouth for prison, do one or two things to run. They yeah, see him testify against her, say he's not a good mother. Which is that they talk that one, that they collect my phone, my everything, so that I don't finish anybody or make any call. They collect my phone, everything for me. So I beg. If you know that you can help us in any way, I'm not talking about money, I'm not looking for money. Help us so that we can get these children, at least in my mom, will still come out for prison. In my mom, in my life, nobody will not steal one for Germany. People will, they know how well. So see the two children. I beg. I beg. I beg, eh? They, 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 they use, they, they use color now, they do the thing. They, they use color, they do the thing because why? Because they are black. I don't get to talk for me for Germany. I don't get anybody who I want, want poor. If you are white, this thing I put to, they don't get the right to put the mother for prison. Because they know see the mother and you don't get the feeling. Operation. With oppression, we don't the two baby with oppression. They see it's too much, it's too much, they're not even so aware. They still put on for prison. Because why I be black, I'm not going to speak for me. The two children they collect them, which is the low feed one to the other German people. Even though they don't want to collect the two children, they will give them an appointment to come to see the children. They don't give me any of the appointments. The mother, they don't give me anything. They just leave me like that. Carry the mother go crazy. I beg. I beg. I'm not talking about money. Anybody will know if you do any help for any year. I beg. Now thank you. Eh?